one of the bigger challenges for us as an organization has been, you know, how do we deal with the, you know, the extreme growth you see in mobile applications and in social media and how do we actually turn that around and actually utilize that to our advantage so we can give consumers a better experience and provide our advertisers um, with a, a more valuable asset to, to get in front of consumers. Currently we're at a stage where we have to make a decision on what we're going to be able to store and we have to get to a level of when do we aggregate and can we just do sampling because our data sets are getting so large. We started looking at alternative ways to try and continue to scale in our environments and a lot of those um, alternatives um, didn't have a lot of draw for me because it would require us to bring in new technologies and train people in new skill sets. The way I would explain the Natiza high capacity appliance to someone who's never heard of it, I'll use the analogy of cars. So it would be a Porsche Cayenne, which is, equates to our Twin Fin 12, versus the Cadillac Escalade, which would be the high capacity appliance. So both are fast, but the Porsche Cayenne is faster and both have a lot of capacity. If I had the Natiza high capacity appliance today, we'd use it in several different ways. We would use it to store new data sources, such as our classified listing data and our inventory data, which are totally new data sources to Kelly Blue Book. We'd also have now an option of when do we need to aggregate and when do we need to sample our large data sources for clickstream and impression data. I can bring in a high capacity appliance. That appliance has, runs on the same platform as our TwinFin 12. I know it fits into our current data warehousing and BI ecosystem. It works with our other tool sets like Informatica, MicroStrategy, and SaaS. So I don't have to go over those hurdles. So it actually provides a, a good integrated way for us and also a very cost-effective way for us to continue to scale our environment. The other thing I would say about the high capacity appliance is that it's a really cost-effective solution. And the reason it's cost-effective is because it can store a lot of data which we need some solution for, for archive, backup, and also for disaster recovery. The alternative we're starting to consider is something like a Hadoop type solution, but Hadoop's completely different platform. Um, you know, it's completely different software, runs on completely different hardware, and takes a completely different skill set, um, which we don't currently have in-house. Um, it also requires a high touch from an administrative perspective and we are used to operating in a tease environment where our, you know, our, our quote unquote administration you know, penalty on that box is really low. If I go with a solution like Hadoop, I know that the administrative costs become much higher and I have to worry about how do I staff for that. When I first learned about the new Natiza high capacity appliance, I was really excited. I said, I want one, when can I get it, and what kind of discount can I get?